This is a Be Kind to Pets video, sponsored by Tupaya Vets. Enjoy! This hamster seems normal. Why is it limping? It has lumps on its underside. How can the hamster be treated? Watch the video to find out. This is a male Roborovsky hamster. His age is estimated to be less than two years old. He is seen to have two large lumps on his body. It is important to find out the history of the patient and its condition. This includes the age, gender and body weight of the patient. Find out the history of the patient's condition such as the duration of the condition and any other relevant details. If you do this quickly, you will be able to keep your consultation short and succinct so as to reduce waiting time for other patients. This is how it should go. So it's two years old, right? It's over yeah, 40, less than two years. Yeah. Less than two years, so 45 grams. It's very, uh, has an excellent appetite. Yeah, yeah I'm yeah, yeah, <laughs> He always is forceful. Yeah. Yeah. How long has this uh, two lumps in, been present? Uh, I think for a couple of months because I don't want him months, to uh, undergo surgery. You don't want him to surgery grows bigger and bigger, right? Yeah, that's true. So this one, I think this is less, this less comes first. damaging. This comes first and then this one. But this one is getting more bigger. After finding out the necessary details of the patient, explain to the owner the condition of the patient and the consequences if no treatment is given. Treatment in this case would be to surgically remove the lumps. This has to be carried out separately because there is a risk of overdose of anesthesia because of the hamster's old age. Also, there is a risk of excessive blood loss. This is how it should go. Okay, the, the thing now is uh, this lump it started has a very small one, right? Mm -mm. So next time it's better to operate, and that will be so easy, you know. Okay. Just give me about the uh, few seconds to operate. Mm -mm. Maybe it's that small, you see? Mm -mm. but now you have the got it so big, mm -mm. so. The risk is a uh, very high anesthetic risk, so if you want to do surgery, then uh, you are prepared to see the hamster being dead you know, on the operating table sometimes. Uh. Oh, okay. What do you say? So if we're not going to do surgery, he will just die after a couple of months. If you don't do surgery, what happens is uh, it goes bigger and bigger and bigger, then it starts to rub against the floor, oh, okay. and then uh, it becomes uh, infected and ulcerated, is it? So there's a reason, and mm -hmm. uh, and uh, it won't be so active as now because the 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 ulcers uh, in the tumor it becomes mm -hmm. smelly and infection mm -hmm. comes in. Uh, so there is a reason because uh, uh, this these are the O O H tumors. Uh, mm -hmm. It's very common in hamsters. The lumps were either tumors or abscesses. After a thorough physical examination, Dr. Singh felt palpation of the lumps which had been growing for three months. He diagnosed them to be subcutaneous tumours. Inform the owner of all the risks involved in the treatment and obtain informed consent. Also, inform the owner about the costs that will be incurred. This is to prevent any ambiguity with the owner and he or she is fully aware of the situation. Usually, the owner is given a consent form to sign. The consent form explains the risks of anesthesia as the hamster is old, as well as possible surgical complications such as bleeding and infections. This is how it should go. Do you want the histology? What's the histology? After that, check whether it's cancer. If not, then uh, we won't do uh, the histology. The no, it's okay, the yeah, we can do it as uh, well. Then the level is cancerous or not? Mm -hmm. Because uh, the cost, uh, normally is the cost. Okay. So uh, roughly, I would estimate the cost to be per tumor would be 150 to 200. Okay. Then the histology will be probably 50 to 100 mm -hmm. estimated. Uh. Okay. So uh, some owners they may not be uh, happy with. It. With this, you will be able to carry out treatment effectively. This is an image of the surgical removal of one of the tumors. Anesthesia used was Zolotil 50. 0 0.01 milliliters was used for 44 grams of body weight. 4-0 absorbable sutures were used to close the wounds. 
The surgery from the first skin incision to the end of stitching took seven minutes. The histology shows that the tumours were benign spindle and cell neoplasm. Both large tumours were removed. Two hours after the surgery, the hamster went home to recover. Thank you for watching. Mm -hmm.